Hi guys, this is Rishabh Kapoor from websoftutorials.com. In the previous tutorial, guys, what were we doing when I was clicking this button? It was uh, showing the hidden div slowly to the screen. It was fading it in. And in this tutorial, guys, we will make one more button. When I when I will click that button, then it will again disappear. This div, I mean, it will be hide that div again. So we'll create that button. I write input type of button. And I'll give it the ID of fade out. No, sorry, value of fade out. And I'll give it the ID of hide me. So, firstly, guys, I'll refresh. What I will do when I click fade in, it will be faded in. When I click this fade out button, it will be disappear again. So, uh, firstly, I'll make a click event for this hide me button, which is used for a fade out. So, I'll write pound sign hide me dot click. Then I write the function. I mean, guys, if the uh, if the div will be on the screen, then it will work. So I'll write p dot one dot fade out, and I write slow. I mean, guys, what will happen? If the div is on the screen, only then it will work. So when I click it, it will not work. So firstly, I'll click fade in. Now, if I'll click fade out, it will be disappear again. So guys, this was about jQuery fade in fade out function. In the next story, guys, we'll talk about jQuery fade toggle function. Means we will fade in and fade out the div using a single button. In this story, we are using two buttons. In the next story, we will do this using a single button so if you have any question in your mind then you can leave a comment below so thanks for watching this video guys don't forget to subscribe my channel to get recent updates about my videos let's see in the next tutorial